we do things for reasons, and we at least care about our interests to some extent. So why do they do this, right? Are their lives made so great by shutting out this voice, the voices on the right, the voices that care about freedom for all people? What's the big payoff, do you think? I mean, I'll, I'll chime in here and say, uh, when you are a leftist, it feels really, really virtuous. You, you do feel good at the end of the day doing what you're doing. And I woke up every single day looking for injustice because that gave me something to fight. It gives your life a sense of purpose, particularly being a member of Gen Z, where it seems like this entire generation is leading a life that is completely devoid of purpose. When you find somebody who goes, hey, there's a battle out there and, and you're one of the people who can fight it. And you know, you'll see in a lot of leftist circles, young people are leading the charge on this. This is why you have young people like David Hogg from the Parkland shooting and Greta Thunberg. It gives these young people a struggle and a battle to have. And it does feel good at the end of the day, at the end of the day to do these things. Uh, what they fail to realize is really they're be, being used as pawns by these elites who truly do stand to gain everything from this, gain resources, gain uh, all of your freedoms, gain your civil liberties. And they don't truly get that point yet. And it was when I recognized that, that the, the, all the ideas that I believe sort of fell apart for me. But when you are in it, it does truly give your life a sense of purpose. 